I just built this AI agent system that uses perplexity for research and creates viral social media posts that we can publish on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, or any platform you want. And this type of post get thousands of likes and millions of views. And in this video, I show you the entire system that auto publishes these type of posts every day without you doing anything. And in case you don't know what is happening right now, and I then release their integration with perplexity that makes our AI agents 10 times better. So in this video, we'll be using perplexity node to search for the idea, we'll be creating the prompt, we'll be generating an image, and at the end, we'll actually publish this entire content on our social media. And if you look closer, it's highly professional. And the best part is we can publish that on any social media we want, such as LinkedIn or even Instagram. When I run this automation, our AI agent is making a research with perplexity. Then it created the title description for the entire content and also an idea for graphic idea AI agent that created the prompt for HTTP request. And afterwards, we put everything together and we publish it on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, LinkedIn, or even Pinterest. When we go ahead to LinkedIn, we see the post, so Google just upped the game by unveiling Gemini Ultra 1.5. Also remember that AI agents and NA Den, so the application we'll be using in this video, is for now pretty popular. So it's great to spend some time because this skill is very valuable. When you learn it, actually you have it for a long time. You can generate um, highly professional content, create powerful automations, or even make the business of it. And even to help you master AI agents and AI automations in today's world, um, I recommend you to check out our AI agents accelerator community. In the classroom, we've got 20 hours and I then course, beginner to pro. You've got a lot of lessons. You've got a voice agents. You've got advanced projects, basic automations. So with this course, you learn everything step by step. Also, we've got plus 110 AA templates for AA agents that you can just take, download, and paste inside an ADN. For now, actually, the price is $29. We increase the price from 100 members. So no pressure. Feel free to check it out. Also in the classroom, we have um, our a lot of different YouTube resources. So for an example, VO3 video generator, TikTok video machine, and um, that is pretty complex. So you can download also the templates for them. So again, feel free to check it out. I will leave the link in the description of this video. But now let me show you how to build this entire project and I will walk you through all of the steps. So the first one is our trigger, which is scheduled trigger. I wanna actually trigger this automation um, at midnight every day. So every day it creates for me perfect content. Then right away we've got our AI agent to create an idea for our content. So here in the instructions, we've got research the most recent and, and interesting news about artificial intelligence and AI automation. And now remember, you can change the topic. For me, it's artificial intelligence. This is my expertise. So I would like to create for my social media content about artificial intelligence. However, it can be about the tech, about healthcare, about any topic you can imagine. So create content for me based on the latest developments in these areas. And why it's so powerful, I mean using perplexity for that specific case. Because remember, perplexity is the best tool for making the research. And then when we can connect that to our AI agent, it's super powerful, okay? Because then also it works with ChatGBT and um, OpenAI models, all right? So we just connect OpenAI chat model, perplexity, think note, and even structured output parser. Um, so yeah, watch this video to the end because it's so powerful. I will show you that and I will prove. Um, for the system message, we've got like pretty long system message where we say that, hey, you're an expert content creator for short, short form posts about AA and automations. Purpose, your job is to research interesting, surprising, or viral worthy insights about AA and AA automation topics. Also remember, again, you can customize it. Go ahead to the chat GBT and say, okay, customize for me these instructions uh, for, for an example, healthcare, okay? Also, for the purpose of this video, I actually, in the YouTube resources inside our community, I provided all of the data um, in the Perplexity social media content machine. So you've got a prompt to copy, system message, also other things such as, um, yeah, the prompt for think notes, structured output parser. Um, you can even copy the Google Sheets. And at the end of this document, um, even you can download, um, it's pretty long, you can download Perplexity posting machine so JSON file um, that you can just download and import inside NIDEN 
um, to have this ready automation. Um, yeah, this ready automation. So for this A agent, again, we've got pretty wide instructions. Uh, for an example, also the content style, output format, so exactly what we want to get. We want to have the title description hashtags. So these variables, um, the instructions, how to use the thing tool. For now, if you wish, you can stop this video and read all of the instructions if you want, you know, like, yeah. Um, however, for now, I won't um, waste your time. And let's cover what extensions we have for this A agent because it's pretty, um, pretty interesting. The first one, of course, is our LLM model. So we use GPT-40 Mini. Uh, we use Perplexity Node, which is the new node inside NADEN. And then we just define um, automatically this field, so the text. Uh, so what it does, it makes the research for us. If we go here and we click on logs, you can see actually how it performed, so this A agent. It used um, our OpenAI, then it thought about its response from the OpenAI. Again, it used OpenAI, then Perplexity to make a research to find the best content for us. Used again OpenAI, ThinkNote, OpenAI, Perplexity, and at the end, it gave us the response. So look how complex this process is. But by doing that, we can get the best content for our, um, you know, for our social media. So... We've got this perplexity node that looks like this. Um, let me show you, that looks like this. And then um, I use the think node. So inside what we have, um, you are filtering and reasoning assistant, um, review the information. So confir the, confirm the news is from the last three days. Um, so in general, I created this agent and it's an AI automation to create the best, you know, like the news for some field. Of course, you can modify it. You don't need to provide, you know, um, like the news have or something else. But for this purpose, we are using the think node to actually refine if it's from um, the three days. Make sure it's related to AI tools and AI agents or automations. Reject anything older or unrelated to AI system updates or automation breakthroughs. Um, and also, if you wish to customize this agent, just pick the description, go ahead to ChatGPT and tell, all right, customize it for healthcare. Simple as that. Uh, then what we have structured output parser, and also again I need to mention like everything you've got explained in this file. So think note the entire prompt structured parser you can just copy paste it. Uh, in the structured parser you've got title, description, and hashtags. And after creating this A agent with these four nodes, we've got the response that contains the title, description, hashtags. Then what we have we've got Google Sheets. So inside we store the data. So I created for you the template that contains the title, description, hashtags, status for the content, if it's done or if it's in progress, and image URL, because also we'll be creating an image. Uh, you can, inside our community, get access to it, and then just click on make a copy and have it, all right? So inside, it looks like this. We only fulfill like these three fields for now. So title, description, hashtags from this um, A agent. So create an idea A agent, and simply here, I just put drag and drop these variables inside there. So we've got JSON output title. The next case, what we do, we use our graphic idea A agent to create for us the prompt that we'll be using um, inside our HTTP request and um, yeah, GBT image generation tool. Inside the prompt, we've got based on this information, create the perfect prompt. So here the title, description, hashtags, and in the system message, We've got the following data, so system message, purpose, prompt requirements, and a lot of more. So in general, it creates a prompt. We only connect with that OpenAI model. And after these um, three steps, actually four, um, so we've got the part which is create prompts, it's done. We move on to the generate images part. We use ChatGBT image generation model. There we provide the URL, um, authentication. Uh, we click on send body and we use JSON. This is the entire code. So we say we use GPT image one, the prompt, so generate a high quality image with this prompt. We provide the variable from graphic idea A agent. Uh, we define actually how many images we wanna get. So one, size, output format. Uh, there you have everything explained. So generate image HTTP request. The link you need to um, actually take and um, yeah, um, just paste and all of the data. Let's move on. The next note will be to convert this file because when we do this, we get like this B64 JSON format. 
we need to convert that to the file. After we do this, um, yeah, we can see our file, so we can click on view. So we've got Gemini Ultra Ultra 1.5 Google. That's perfect. Um, so it's pretty simple. Inside the base 64 input field, you just drag and drop this variable. All right, you just drag and drop it here, and then it's ready to use. It converts your file. After you do this, um, we've got get image URL node. For this case, the method is post. We use uh, the application, which is Cloudinary um, dot API. Um, so for this case, let me show you. We've got Cloudinary API. You just need to um, create your account. So sign up for free. When you log in, the first thing you need to do, you need to take your cloud name. So inside the home, you've got your cloud name. And then when you just copy this entire link, so URL, uh, you just paste it here. Inside this space, you need to provide your cloud name. So for now, again, let me copy my cloud name and just provide it um, right here. So it just indicates you you would like you to use your account. You know, you just um yeah, just connect by this way your account with um this HTTP request. Then what's very important, um there you send the body, um you pick form data and then, then binary file file and data. So you indicate that you would like to yeah, just upload this entire file, so the data, which is named data. For the next parameter, um, you say you want to get the form data, then just provide the name, which is upload preset, so exactly type it, and the value you need to provide your preset. When you go ahead to Cloudinary, um, you need to click on the settings, right here in the left bottom corner, click on upload, and here add upload preset. So just name it as, for an example, an Aiden um, test. Um, switch the signing mode to unsigned. And then just you can just click on save. So by this way, uh, you can just take the name of your preset. So an Aiden test. Uh, let me just copy it here. And inside an Aiden in the value, just provide the name of it. And it should work. Uh, so by this way, we get a material. And then right away, we provide edit fields node that actually stores our different um, IDs for um, different accounts. So for an example, Facebook, Facebook page ID, Instagram, Pinterest, and LinkedIn, or even Pinterest. And the point is you can ask, all right, from where should I take these, um, yeah, these values? And I need to say for this case, so for uploading our content on social media, such as Facebook, like Instagram, Pinterest, LinkedIn, and TikTok even, we'll be using Bloodado, which is the platform that allows us to do this stuff. And now we need to remember that these platforms, so for an example, Facebook, like TikTok, are very sensitive um, to uploading the data, to connecting with them, and Bloodado allows us um, yeah, to, do the, to do all of the stuff. So when we go ahead, actually, to our settings, you can see that we can log in with Twitter, with LinkedIn, we can log in with Facebook, with TikTok, Instagram, and a lot of more, Blue Sky, YouTube. Um, so as you can see, I've got my accounts. So simply what you need to do in that case, you've got the free trial. So you'll put the link in the description of this video. You have that free trial. Um, but after you set up your account, you go ahead to settings and you click login with Facebook. After you do this, you should continue with your profile. So then um, it will be your page. And then just, you know, you can copy your account ID. So just click on the copy, go ahead to um, your NADN, and inside the Facebook, just paste it here, this value. For the Facebook page ID, you need to go ahead to Facebook. And when you are in your Facebook page account, click on an account, there on the settings, settings. Then you just go ahead to page details. And you find the tab, which is page transparency. And from here, you just copy and paste your page ID. So simply, you do this by this way. Um, and for the rest of the applications, you go over to Bloodado. Um, and then you just log in with these applications. After the edit field node, you upload the content to Bloodado. So simply, it looks by this way. We provide the method, which is post URL, which is this one. We use generic credential type, so header authentication. And inside the Bloodato, uh, we just provide the name, which is Bloodato API key. 
and we pick our API key from um, here. So you can just copy your API key. That's pretty everything. Uh, and then what you, what you do, you send the body, use the JSON, and simply you provide the URL. You provide the URL from um, this get image URL node. That's pretty everything. You upload the content to Blotado, and from the Blotado, we can upload this content to multiple different platforms. Then what you do, you just publish the content to Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, LinkedIn, and Pinterest. For the Instagram, we've got the method, which is post. We've got the URL authentication. So again, we use the Blotato. We send body and we use JSON format. So here we've got a post target, target type, which is Instagram content. So text, we provide the text from this um, create an idea a agent. So the description and platform Instagram, media URLs. So there we use the blood data URL, account ID from edit fields. So for this case, we've got Instagram. So we just drag and drop this entire variable. And that's really everything. After we do this, um, yeah, our content is published on social media. And for other specific cases, I won't talk about this in this video. Actually, you've got everything explained uh, yeah, inside our community. So when we scroll down, you've got how to publish um, the content on Instagram, all of the details, and um, the JSON code, how to publish it on TikTok, so other different code, how to publish it on Facebook, and a lot of more. And after we publish our content on social media, we just provide a Google Sheets note where we just save, um, we provide a status, and we save our image URL. So we can upload just it from the blood aid So when we do this, we can just save the data and mark it as done. And for this video, this is everything. So we built our automation that publishes the content for us. That is highly interesting because actually, you know, again, it makes the research using perplexity, chat GBT, think note, it creates for you images. It creates for you the content and publishes that on any platform you want. And with the blood Ato, you may have a multiple different platforms. So around 10, okay? Um, also remember, um, you can check out our school community. So A Agents Accelerator, we've got a huge value insight. We've got, again, 20 hours in Aiden course. Um, we talk about AI, about automations. We've got 80 members, so we have already just started. But still, uh, we provide a lot of valuable data here. We've got a lot of different experts from many fields. We've got our classroom with a lot of different resources about Make and then even premium templates. We have 30 day AI automation agency roadmap. So you can just learn how you can set up your AI automation agency on your own. It's pretty long and we have a lot of value here. Again, for now, um, the price is pretty low, $29. However, no pressure. Thank you for watching this video. And for now, I will see you in the next material.